just heard you found the one you've been looking You've been looking for I wish I would've known that wasn't me Cause even after all this time I still wonder Why I can't move on Just the way you Before we get into this video, I just wanted to let you guys know that I did an interview with Vlog Nation And it's the first time that I've ever done a written interview and I tried really hard to be able to provide some value So if you guys are interested in that, I will have it linked down below So for today's video, we are going to be doing some DIY spring room decor And I'm really excited about this because I don't think I've done a DIY room decor video in a while Well, it hasn't really been that long, but maybe like three weeks or something So yeah, I really hope that this video can give you guys some ideas on how to like make your room more pretty and soft and spring. Also today's video is a collab with Danica and we have never collabed before but she seriously has an amazing channel and she's also going to be doing a spring video and in her video she's going to be doing some DIY spring room organization. Her videos are such amazing quality so you guys should definitely go check her out, definitely go like her video, subscribe to her video and tell her that your girl Savannah sent you. Alright and here's a clip from her. Hey guys, it's me, Danica. I am also making a DIY video, but mine is a DIY spring room organization. So if you are done watching Savannah's channel, you can go ahead and click on the link down below and it'll take you to my channel as well as my video, so I would really appreciate that. Now we can go ahead and head back to Savannah. Alright you guys, so give this video a thumbs up if you have a thumb and let's get into it. So this DIY is so cheap, but it is seriously one of my favorites. I picked up four of these flower vines from the dollar store. They were $1.25 each, and then I just hung them up on the wall. I feel like it adds so much room decor, and I feel like it can just make your wall look really pretty, and it can take up a lot of room, and it can just like really dress up a wall for such a low cost. This company called Ankit sent me this tapestry and I just thought that it was so gorgeous and like really fun and I feel like it's a very spring. Tapestries are very popular right now. It takes up my whole entire wall so I don't have to worry about any other decorations and I don't know, I just feel like it looks really good on camera. It's a really great backdrop. I'm just overall very, very happy with this. We don't talk anymore. We don't talk anymore We don't talk anymore Like we used to do so I've seen these washi tape light switches all over the online and I decided to try it out myself. So I just took off my light switch with a screwdriver and then I picked out two different washi tapes and I thought these were like pretty spring themed so I'm just kind of putting them there on a diagonal and then I'm just going to cut the access. All this time I still wonder why I can't move on. And now I'm just cutting out the actual holes of the light switch, so that middle part there, and then there are these two circles, and that's for the screws. So now I'm just screwing everything back in, and this is seriously so easy. It's a great way to redecorate your room, even if it's just kind of like a little change, but it is so cheap and very, very cute. So this next one is pretty basic, but it is just to add some fake flowers into some pretty vases. Honestly, you guys, these turned out so cute. I was always against fake flowers, but I just feel like it adds so much color to my apartment. So I picked up a fake carton of eggs from the dollar store. It was only about $2. So for the first egg, I'm just going to be drawing on some hearts. I picked out a pink sharpie and then a black sharpie. I thought this was really cute. The beauty about this DIY is you can get super creative with it. And then for the second one, I was using a gold metallic marker and I made these like squiggly lines and then all these dots and stuff like that. So gold metallic markers are really fun for drawing on designs with eggs. Baby, let me take your hand. So for displaying these, I put these on some wall plaques, but you can definitely do whatever you want. I feel like just putting them in a bowl would be very cute as well. Now it is the time where I respond to your comments. So my last video was 15 life hacks that everyone should know. I will have that linked up here in case you want to see it, but let's get responding. 
Lydia Park says, are you going to do a 100,000 subscriber giveaway when you get to 100,000 subscribers? I'm not really sure. I haven't really thought about what I'm going to be doing for 100,000, but that's coming up really soon and I kind of can't believe it. I was thinking about maybe live streaming the reaction of when I hit 100,000 and maybe I would do that on you now. So let me know in the comments down below if you guys would want to see that. But yeah, I will definitely let you guys know if I do end up doing a 100,000 subscriber giveaway. Well, of course I'll let you know because there'll be a video about it. Kayla Thomas says, so many life hacks in my subscription. Comment down below and maybe you will see your screen on, on the face, the face on the screen. All right, you guys, that is it for this video. Definitely, definitely, definitely go check out Danica's video. Go subscribe to her and send her some love. All right, that is it, that is all, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.